Hello fellow gamers, welcome back to Super Mario 64, Kevin J 2010 here. In the last episode, we got rid of pretty much all the stars in Jolly Roger Bay, except for one which we need a special item for, which we don't have yet. In this episode, we're going to be entering the door with the big star on it. The big star! Reacting to the star power, the door slowly opens. Don't know why they have doors like that. Oh, Peach has her own level. That's really cool. It, oh, geez, it's Bowser. Well, let's go into... Whoa! Okay, so a lot of things happen there. bah ha, ha you've stepped right into my trap, just as I knew you would. I warn you, friend, watch your step. Oh, geez. Yep, this is the Bowser level. As you saw, there are red coins here, and that is actually a secret star you can get in these places, which I am going to get them while I do these levels. Okay, now to get the first two red coins, you want to hit that switch and then almost kill yourself. That's a good idea. Oh, Jesus, that was bad. You want to run over here. There we go. You gotta be careful on those. Okay, I generally prefer turning the camera behind me. Because you can actually... It, it just works a little bit better. It's, it's the only mission here. Is to get the uh, eight red coins in here. And in fact, these uh, these levels, besides the eight red coins, actually don't give you a star. I often forget this when I play through the game, because I'm so used to other games where boss battles give you stars, but they, they don't actually. There's a life here, so that way you can sort of grind lives, which someone thankfully corrected me, because I could not remember the phrase I was trying to use to explain that. I always wonder though, like, what is up with these worlds? Like, why is it just like, ow. Why is it like, who built something this like weirdly in the middle of space? Should it just be like a room or something with maybe all this? But no, it's like random craziness. Oh jeez. Okay, that was a little scary. I have a feeling I can long jump to that, but I'm not going to. Oh Jesus, I am doing, I'm just like playing like as if nothing really matters. I don't know. Nothing else matters. Anyway. Metallica. Metallica. I actually saw Metallica live once. Very good. Very good performers. One of the few concerts where I, although I was sitting like a lo like loads of rows back because it was it would be expensive to not be sitting rows back. That was a bad idea. It would be expensive for me not to be sitting like pretty far back. Actually, like it was a pretty decent show. Like I was quite surprised with how well it was. Okay, you want to come down here. There's a star. There's a red coin over here. You really want to use the camera to your advantage in this place. Because the camera can really, really screw you up sometimes. If you didn't move the camera in these places, you would actually... You'd be hindering yourself not to. And what do you know? I forgot a red coin somewhere. Oh, I can see it already. Oh jeez, no, 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 I know where to go. I know where to go, okay. You long jump from here. Oh wait, can I even make that? I don't think I can make that. Oh, I know what I do. There we go. There we go. There is the a red coin star. A little bit lo longer than expected. Well, I could have made that. And I could have made that too. Oh jeez, I nearly jumped to my death. Anyway. Oh gee, uh, You know, I was actually playing Sunshine the other day. Yesterday, in fact. And I noticed. That game, like, I really don't like Sunshine. Like, I do. Like, it's a fun game. But it has its moments where I really just can't play it. There we go. That's the fifth castle secret star. And here we go into the pipe. I just could not play Sunshine. I love this music. Tough luck, Mario. Princess Toadstool isn't here. Gwahaha. Go ahead. Just try to grab me by the tail. You'll never be able to swing me around. A, a wimp like you won't throw me out of here. Never. Ha! <laughs> Music here is freaking amazing. Let's go. 
Anyway, once you grab him by the tail, you just spin him around and hit the B button to throw him. So long, gay Bowser. And you want to throw him into those spiky bomb things, which I screwed up. This music's really good because it actually has, like, considering I'm a drummer, this song has actually a really good music track behind it. Like, a really good drum track. Oh, I missed it again. Come on, why is this so hard? Coins do come out of his flames, actually. So if you need health like that, the little embers will burn off eventually and turn into coins. Oh. I took a lot of damage from- Oh, Jesus. No, 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 no. Oh, I killed myself. Great. I meant to grab his tail and then I- Yeah, okay. Luckily, when you die, it just spawns you back into here. Luckily. Like, I've actually been meaning to learn how to play this song on drums. Just because that has such an interesting drum track. There we go. You throw him into it, it'll blow up. He'll be down. And guess how many hits he takes? One! What is this? I was a bit careless. This is not as I had planned. But I still hold the power of the stars, and I still have Peach. ha ha! You'll get no more stars from me. I'm not finished with you yet. But I'll let you go for now. You'll pay for this later. What is this? There we go. We got the... Yeah. We got the key. It, as I said, it doesn't give you a star. It gives you a key. little interesting point there. Anyway, so now that we've defeated Bowser, we still have some time this episode. Um, I think I'm going to open the door that this key pertains to. Now, you want to come into here. As you can see, there's a boo down there. There is a level down there, but I'm not going to take care of it yet because I actually can't get all the stars there without another item. So, with this key, we put it into the door, which I always, always found confusing. Why is the keyhole in the middle of two doors? I don't know. And here we are. This is the second area of the game, I guess you could call it. This is the underground. We already have 30 stars, so we can actually already go into here. I'm not going to do that, obviously, because that would just be weird. What you want to do is you want to come this way. Now, there's a couple of secret stars you can get now, now that we have, uh, now that we... I believe after 15... There's a couple of hidden stars we can get while we're down here. For example, this bunny here, which is actually known as a MIP, is holding a star. Now, if you can grab it, this MIP will show up after 15 stars, so don't feel like you need to get a whole lot. Don't feel like 30 is like, oh, geez, 30 stars. I don't want to do every star in the game. Well, you only need to wait till 15 to get this one. But he's really hard to grab, as you can see. Uh, 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 get over here. Oh, my God, really? Oh, gee, uh, uh, okay, come on. Uh, dang it. Okay. <clears throat> ah. It used to be pretty decent at getting him. I remember I used to get him, like, first time. Ah. Maybe you can creep up on him? Let's see if you can. Nope, oh, you can't. Okay, I tried. Come on. I got it. Oh, I didn't... How did that not... How? Why? That should have counted. Oh. Oh. Yes. Jeez, okay. Yeah, one hand me, brute. I'm late. So late. I must make haste. This shiny thing? Mine. It's mine. Finders, keepers, losers. Late, late, late. Ouch. Take it then. A gift from Bowser it was. Now let me be. I have a date. I cannot be late for tea. Oh, that's so cute. Yep, there's the star that the MIP was holding. Here we go! Wow, another Power Star Mario game is more courage from the power of the castle. Do you want to save? You bet! Okay, now there's some more hidden stars we can get. But I'm actually going to work on grabbing a special thing. We're going to activate another hat. Yes, we are. We're going to activate another hat. And you may want to do this because I may not have shown it, but every time you restart the game, 
every time you restart the game, you have to start from outside the castle. Now you're probably thinking you have to run all the way back down here, you have to go inside and all that. This also helps you with that because you can actually enter the basement from the outside. Anyway, so you ground pound this, and you ground pound this, you actually drain the water out. Not only do you drain the water out, but you drain it out of the moat at Peach's Castle. This is very important to do because after you've drained it, there's that there, which is not where we're going. Oh, yes, it is. That's where we're going. Right? Yeah, down here is where it lets you out. You want to come into here. In the N6, in the DS version of this game, there's actually a... You have to use Wario to get in here. Welcome to the Vanished Cap Switch course. All of the blue blocks you find will become solid once you hit the Cap Switch. You'll disappear when you put on the Vanished Cap, so you'll be able to elude enemies and walk through many things. Try it out. Yes, this is the, the Vanished Cap. It is blue. Basically makes Mario invisible. Okay, now I'm going to have to... Now, much like the Red Cap area, there is a... Whoa, and I already missed the red coins. Okay. There is... A, I think there's a way to get back up there. There may be. If not, I'll just restart. Yeah, I figured there would be a way up. You can just barely get back up. Oh, no, 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 no. Use, use your little kick, because that kick gives you, like, a little boost. And just be really careful. There we go. That's another one. This level is really easy for grinding lives, as you can see. Okay, I really don't like doing this place. And it's not even the fact that it's hard, it's just... You know, there's already three lives right there, Jesus. That's a lot of lives. You can't go first person here, which always confused me. And I think that's the last of them, yeah. Okay, so we got the four there. And you just want to run ahead. Okay, so once you've made your way over here... You want to... Whoa, jeez, okay. Make your way up here. There's a red coin right there. And a red coin right there. But the problem with that is you're going to have a problem. Okay, we made it. Jesus. I don't care if I got hurt, I made it. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no! What is this? No! Oh, I was doing so good. Ah. Uh, <laughs> okay, back to this part. Oh Jesus, oh Jesus, oh Jesus. Okay. Oh, Je no, 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 no. Jesus, I don't like this part. As you can plainly see, I really don't like it. And then you backflip on top of here. Last red coin is right there. And what you want to do is you want to hit this switch. You just stepped on a vanish cap switch. Now every blue block in the game is now visible. So you can hit it. And we have the vanish cap, which means we can now walk through certain walls like this kind. Yep, you just walk right through it. Here we go! Yep, we've got that star, and now that is another one of Castle Secret Stars. And you know, I think I have time to show you guys one more. I already have time to show you guys one more, one more heat secret star I can get, and it is not hard to get at all. It's actually probably the easiest star in the game to get, once you get here, that is. You come back into here. You want to go into this room. Now this room has a level in it, as you can see. I will warn you right now, this level is probably my least favorite level in the game. But if you talk to this toad right here, instead of punching it, do, 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 do. Hold on to your hat. If you lose it, you'll be injured easily. If you do lose your cap, you'll have to find it in the course where you lost it. Oh boy, it's been looking... It's not looking good for Peach. She's still trapped somewhere inside the walls. Please, Mario, you have to help her. Did you know where the enemy world inside the walls? Yep, it's true. Bowser's troops are there, too. Oh, here, take this. I've been keeping it for you. Yes. The designers of the game couldn't find a place for three extra stars, so they put them in the toads. Yes, there's three of them. I'm giving you the warning now, so there's two more of those. 
But I think for now we are going to end this episode. So, next time on Super Mario 64, we are going to be heading off to the next world in the game. And I'm not going to do any of the basement ones. As I said, I was actually going to do um, the level with the booze. So I will see you guys all with the booze. I just thought of alcohol. No, you know what I mean. The one with the booze. You know, the ghosts. And I hit a wall for some reason. Yep, we're going to go that way. See you guys all next time.